Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing three handbags in my collection that have just been on repeat for the past couple of months. These are like my ride or die bags that I've been honestly literally wearing day after day and not switching out of these three. I will say I'm kind of cheating with one of the bags because it is a newer bag to me. However, I am recording this in August of 2022. This bag is a staple for summer. It's just a really easy summer bag so I feel I really need to mention it because I have been wearing it so much since I got it. But before I get into the video, I do want to introduce myself in case you are new here. Welcome. My name is Alyssa and I have a blog called The Gals Guide and I come on here and I review my handbags. I talk about a lot of luxury brands and some contemporary brands as well. I do have a contemporary bag in this video and it is literally the best coach bag out there in my opinion. So if you love handbags just as much as I do, you should definitely consider subscribing down below hit that little red button I would love to have you join this little community with me here and to my current subscribers thank you so much for being here I'm truly grateful for you and I just love chatting with you in the comments down below I really appreciate all of your support so thank you so much again that being said let's get into the video I'm gonna talk about my newest handbag first and that is my Louis Vuitton pochette accessoire in the Damier Azure print and this has the leather shoulder strap as well there's nothing happening on the bottom the sides are the same on each side and it's honestly just a really simple bag it does have a beautiful zipper on the top and then this is just really like an everyday catch-all for me I am using it right now I love this bag so much because it's so lightweight, it's so easy to carry, it fits everything that I need, and when I did my unboxing video on this, I shared that I really didn't like the way that the leather strap attached here to the gold like you had to kind of feed it through it was very confusing and I didn't like how it looked so I bought this little adapter on Amazon I will link it in the description box below and it's made a world of difference I really prefer wearing this as a shoulder bag I thought that I was going to prefer wearing it as a crossbody. however I actually really love it as a shoulder bag it's very lightweight I don't even feel it on me and I'll show you where it lays on me it's like a really nice length I've just been loving this bag I have nothing bad to say about it honestly at first I wasn't super crazy about the way that this looked but it's kind of grown on me I am gonna do an updated review video on this and like wear and tear and stuff as I continue to wear it but I had to mention it because it's just such an amazing bag so I'm gonna show you what this looks like on me as a shoulder bag so it just sits right here under the shoulder you do have quite a bit of room Room, so it's not like right under your armpit or anything you have it really nicely on the side here and this is what I prefer I don't like it to be too high up you have some like comfortability here so that's what it looks like the next bag that I'm going to share is going to be absolutely no surprise to anybody. I talk about this bag all the time. I rave about it on my Instagram. I have like three different reviews on it on YouTube already. However, it is the Coach Pillow Madison bag in the black. It has the black pewter hardware. This beautiful buttery pillow leather is to die for. And then it has this amazing back pocket that does have a magnetic closure. and. The chain straps are so lightweight, so beautiful, so easy to carry. And then you just twist it open on the front. And the interior has this beautiful suede on the bottom with the leather carried throughout the top. And then you have a zipper pocket back there and a magnetic pocket on the front, which I think makes the world of difference to carry things that you don't want to lose and you just want to keep them separate. I wear this bag all the time. This bag is an 11 out of 10 in my opinion. Like it is one of the top rated bags in my collection. I did compare this to the YSL Lulu bag and I will say, spoiler alert, if you didn't watch that video, I think that this bag is superior to that one. This is absolutely worth the price point. This retails for $495 in the United States and I genuinely think that it is one of the best bags out there. So I can't say enough good things about it. I won't go crazy on it. I will leave the other reviews in the description box down below if you're interested in the full reviews that I have. I also have this in another color. I have it in the army green, so I will leave that too. And I just love the black. I wear it all the time. I wear black with 
basically every outfit. I have black pants on today. So this bag just goes with everything for me. I wear it to work. I wear it casually. I wear it dressy. And it just fits so much, which you'll see in the review video if you watch that. Last but not least, I'm going to share with you the final bag that I have had on repeat, which is my YSL Lou camera bag in the gray with the gold hardware. This is like a charcoal gray, but it's very, very neutral. And it has a zipper closure on the top, and then the back is just the chevron print. There are no feet on the bottom. And then the interior is one big kind of catch-all, and then it has a pocket back here. And it's like a cloth material in here. I absolutely love this bag. I didn't think that it was going to hold up as well as it has. I've been wearing this all the time. I just think that this gray with the gold hardware is so neutral and so casual and classy. While the YSL logo is very luxurious looking, it's also very minimal in my opinion. So I do wear this as an everyday casual bag. What I also love about this bag is it's so lightweight. Like you just don't feel like you're carrying anything when you have this on and you can fit so much. It does have an adjustable leather crossbody strap as well and it just works for me. Like this is honestly one of my top rated bags because it's so minimal I think and I do think that the gray with the gold just works for my wardrobe and they have so many other colors of this but if you are drawn to this color and you're kind of like I don't know if it's going to match a lot it absolutely does it works with everything I would say this is like a very neutral gray and I love the gold hardware on it I think it's absolutely stunning I would consider getting this in another material they do have it in like raffia and velvet which I would totally get. So I don't have this in another color, but I probably would. I would get all of these bags in another color. I know I have the coach in another color, but I think that they're all absolutely worth having multiple. So that there is something to be said about that because these are, you know, pricier bags. So that is going to conclude this video. If you're still here with me, thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions about any of these bags, please feel free to leave that in the comments down below. I would love to answer those for you. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up so I know to do more videos like this in the future. Thank you so much again for watching, and I hope to see you in my next video.